It's Wes with Tadlock Roofing. We're here on top of the building that houses the uh, sleep center, Dr. Dulay's building. Um, the roof actually has quite a bit of pitch on it from front to rear. What we see is an old <coughs> three ply or two ply, looks like, excuse me, two ply hot mop system. Uh, the weakness of these systems are the seams where these areas are overlapped. That's where it'll begin to fail. It's been coated with an aluminum coat top coat to keep the sun off of it, which is starting to deteriorate rapidly. You can see all the dark spots. That's where it's coming off. This is your uh, roof access panel, by the way, although there is no ladder on the inside. You can see down in there to the uh, ceiling tiles. Looks like there may have been an issue with a leak before because this material is newer. Same thing, though. The, the weakness of these is the seams. You can see how these seams are open. Water blowing rain can get in those um, all the way along the top here. And then <clears throat> um, same thing at the bottom. So what I'd recommend for this roof would be a either a Duralast system um, or a uh, probably a Geico system for this roof. Okay, so I'll put that information together for you, and that would be you know cover the entire roof area. Um, I'll also give you <clears throat> just an idea of um, if you just wanted to try to repair only the front and the rear slope set you know these these uh, modified sections we could um, I can give you a, a quote for that also okay and in that case what I would do is come from on top of this metal on the outside edge over the top of it down along the inside and all the way out about three or four feet up here onto this roof system and I'd do the same thing up front and then along the side wall so basically the entire perimeter of the roof okay thank you